Drive Super Doppler 7 weather. 443, welcome to Wednesday, my friends. We are looking live over the Albuquerque Metro from Albuquerque's west side, that kind of high advantage point by the Coors Bypass there lets us look down on the Cottonwood Mall. You can see Albuquerque's east side in the background there. Hey, living on the mild side of things for a couple more days, and it's only getting warmer here. It's a full moon night as well, and look at the bright overnight skies, kind of a reflection of the light off in the distance, and also that bright moonlight. As we look down on the Moriarty area, just kind of a cool view back there in east central New Mexico. Skies sure are quiet statewide. No active winter weather to have to travel through this morning. Uh, we're living on the warm side of Things through the end of the day Friday, but I'll tell you what Friday becomes tough to enjoy as some strong winds crank up. Look how close we get to record highs. Not so much today. Forecast high 60 record 66, but a pair of 64s with record highs at 65 will be interesting to watch for Thursday and Friday. And then the bottom still on track to just fall out this weekend, turning much colder into Saturday and Sunday. A little bit of wintry precip as well. Now here's Friday when things start to get interesting. Still on the warm side of a strong cold front. There will be some big time winds on Friday, especially across the high terrain. Best chance at any rain or mountain snow is going to be across northern New Mexico. Mexico, it looks like now we look ahead towards Saturday and we're still focused on northern New Mexico for that chance at picking up some snowfall accumulation. Yes, these are afternoon temperatures with strong gusty winds in the 30s and 40s for most of us. Sunday is when skies will have settled down. No more wind issues to deal with. We will have sunshine, but look at our afternoon temperatures cooling off in southern New Mexico as well. By Sunday, we may not even hit 40 degrees in Albuquerque. So the next couple of afternoons with the mild temperatures, be sure and make some plans to get outside and enjoy the uh, the mild side of this uh, late fall early winter season. Todd